very quickly before we step into the word this morning, I'd like to encourage every one of us, the youth in particular, take your time and be part of this convention. Why? You are in your age of discovery. You are in your age of discovery. Your young men shall see vision. You are in the age of discovering where you belong in the race of life. Two, you are in your age of strength. Written to you young men because you are strong. And four, I mean three, you are in your age of responsibility. From 20 years upward, even unto 30, you are responsible for your, the outcome of your life. Responsible. Parents, caution. Stop putting adult sons and daughters on your lap. You are not building, you are destroying. Stop. Stop there. Stop. That's not success, that's failure. I've never added a dime in my life to any of our sons and daughters working in this place. They earn what others earn. Stop! They bless me today. Stop. Your wealth is not your inheritance. It's your accomplishment. Stop. <laughs> Stop. I've never asked in my life, are, are you paying school fees for your children? You have to. Stop. Push them out. They are in their age of discovery. Push them out. I started building my Christian library since I was 20. Push them out. They're in their age of discovery. At 16, I caught the word is good for a young man that he bears his yoke in his youth. I was one six. We are in a very terrible era where adults are put on the back of aging parents to break their back. I don't care what education you give a child, if you don't connect him to God, you have lost him. <laughs> Wake up. I 2022 is for all youth in this church. Yes, yes, sir. Who wants to make some money out of life? Yes, sir. Be there. I started attending conference when I was 16, and I'm still attending. Awesome. God is not slow. I had it in 1970. And so my life was prepared for the patience of faith in the race of life. Faith without patience will lead to crisis. The followers of them through faith and patience inherited the promise. I've never borrowed. I'm just patient. No, I'm comfortable at every face I am. When I'm set for the next, it takes me there. That seed was sown into my life when I was 16. In the precious name of Jesus, every single youth here will beat their parents. Amen. In terms of impact. Amen. And they will still be humble. Thank you, Jesus. You're in the house. It's your turn. From 20 years and above, those who didn't know what to make as a choice, they perished in the wilderness. <laughs> so from 20 years and above, everyone 
that will not take responsibility will go down. You will not go down. Amen. You will not go down. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Also, because of the IAC, we are going to be having all of us are youths. Praise God. <laughs> Abraham saw a vision at 75. Moses saw his own as 80. And only young men see vision according to scriptures. So they were all young men. So uh, midweek service for the week for the month is uh, swallowed up with uh, Aya, and we're going to be having feet washing for dominion. <laughs> Hallelujah. So get ready, don't say it's for youth. It's for you as a seed of Abraham. So come on there. Moses said, the prophet shall the Lord send me like unto me. Him shall ye hear what he will say to you. So, and Jesus is that prophet. And his father has sent him, so as he sent us, at 80, you can get a new chapter. Jesus. So get ready for it and you'll be blessed. As our feet is washed, wherever the soul of that feet we step into shall be given to you. Amen. I don't want to see you will never come your direction anymore. Amen. Wherever you appear, you'll be celebrated. 